Yes, yes guys, Don Wine here. Last year you may have remembered we went to Ibiza with views to kick off the Europe tour with the drum bass on the bike. This year we're going to be working on another project, building a completely new bike from scratch so we can take it across the whole world. All right guys, so we are here in the middle of nowhere. Uh, views have hooked me up with a guy called Mike, who I'm told can build anything. So, how is he gonna do with my bike? He's gonna electrify it, better decks, better speaker. I'm Mike. And I'm Jimmy. And we're the guys that people come to when they want the weird and wonderful build. And I've been having a little look at what Dom's doing on YouTube, and I tell you what, I'm really excited about getting our hands on his bicycle. Hello, guys. Good to see you, Dom. How you doing? Not bad. So how did you come about this, first of all? <laughs> um, well, through lockdown and... Um, you must have got bored in lockdown. I, I was bored. Right, what have we got? Right, so we've got, obviously you can see here, decks, we all need them. Do you mix while you're riding? Yeah, so obviously in today's age, we've got USB slots. You, know, you probably remember vinyl. I'm not yeah, saying you're we old, but yeah. I definitely knew we're all on vinyl. There you go, so. And then obviously we've got the speaker. Right, Dom, I've got to bring up the elephant in the room. Yeah. Right, this big appendage here, <laughs> that's a hell of a thing. Yeah, what is that? It's, uh, it's the camera pole, and it's um, actually probably, you say it's an elephant in the room, it was an elephant in the room for me when I built built the bike because um, we didn't know where to mount the camera. So we've got the GoPro that goes on here um, and yeah the phone which forces through there. The phone obviously runs a live stream and the GoPro will be recorded locally so. Right you two are going to take the mic out of me because I know you're going to know. I know go you're going to know. Yeah. Go what is that? This is a receiver. I've got two transmitters that go onto other speakers that people are carrying. And so we can potentially put those aerials antennas up. Anything's possible. Anything is possible. I'll tell you what, Don, Mike, uh, it's got a piece of paper back there with, which is blank and got our names on it. Should we uh, go and do some sketches? Yeah, sure thing. It's got my name on it. <laughs> <laughs> got up here, you've got your camera, yep. which is obviously important for streaming your content. Yeah, yeah. We could potentially mould the pole so that at the very top is the GoPro and yeah. then straight off that pole we've got yeah. a magic arm that holds onto the right. phone. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Then, then the other thing you've got is a speaker which at the moment is here. Right? Yeah, yeah, so we've got the noise going out that way. Reason being is if it's, it's, it's actually not to be us going at me but the mic feedback would be astronomical. So, so you put stuff in here right yeah, now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Along with the, the battery and stuff, like it, it, I put like a, a couple of bags. So you you're, to... gonna, you're gonna block the sound. Well, that's a big no. <laughs> <laughs> Can we project it out different ways? Because there is one area of the bike that hasn't been used at all, and that's this area here, isn't it? Yes, but just bear in mind that people sometimes clatter into you over there. Like they clatter sat there. into you? Yeah, it gets a bit ruthless, you know, we've got all sorts of animals, dogs on the ride. There's a lot of crashing and... going on in this. Yeah. <laughs> you know the old panniers at yeah. the back? Yeah. You know, you, you did something here and you put maybe a, a, a few more speakers on the back here. So now you've got some sound coming out. Yeah, that way. If we're going to start adding things, we probably need to add a bit of performance to the bike, don't we? Yeah, 100%. Take it into the, the realms of an e-bike. You are happy with the idea, so I'm give that a tick of adding more sound. I'm, I'm happy with adding more sound. So well, then you've got, you're projecting out to the front, you're projecting yeah. out to the side. There's more yeah. people dancing now. Yeah, yeah. How do you dance on a bike? I just have one hand with my microphone and, you know. <laughs> <laughs> There's two things that are fixed. Mm -hmm. Your mixing desk and your cameras. And yep. that's, that's with a big old pole that comes down to there. Mm -hmm. And then this is on a big old, the mixing desk is on a big old pole there. At the end of an event, you might like mix music yeah, for another yeah. hour. Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, I'm, I'm thinking about um, something that's modular that is going to give you storage. Yeah. It's almost like this whole piece is going to be removable. Um, it's aluminium, it's lightweight. We'll put some holes in it for lightweight uh, thing, but we can also put some shelving in it be removable so it slot into this space yeah but the whole thing could also come out so you'd almost have like a mobile platform yeah it's actually miss mixing this yeah that goes into the bike yeah but you could remove it adjust it it sounds like i need to get onto making this unit yeah and i'll get onto the tech you need to get onto the tech yeah everything is going to be fit to purpose yeah everything's going to be modern it's going to be future proofed and we're going to upgrade every single thing on the bike let's do right. it let's do Sweet. it We've looked at some really cool designs uh, with the guys, Jim and Mike. I've put in my input, they've put in their input, and I believe we're going to come up with something pretty epic 
we are now on to looking at the tech side of things and we're gonna start unboxing what we've got. Here it is, all your new tech. Let's start. That. Yeah, that is fresh. That is shiny. So tell me a bit about this. RX3, latest model of the Pioneer controller series. Mate, it just looks sick. Nice. It just looks beautiful. We've got, we've got plenty of places where we can actually, yeah, can the, actually mount to it. Four. So this is basically a battery with an inverter yeah, powered in, so you can get in, yeah. 230 volts straight out of this single Yeah, box. yeah, yeah. You can't have power unless you're at home or you've got an actual generator. It's such a nice compact unit, isn't it? Yeah. I wonder what is in here. Cables. Brilliant. <laughs> we were so excited <laughs> about that box, and all it is is cables. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, there's another couple of things I've got up my sleeve. Yeah. One, of course, is your is your um, transmitter, which, yeah. which transmits to other speakers. Yeah. And another one, because you do live streaming, yeah. you've got to have a Wi-Fi router. Cool. We're going to get that all together, plug the whole system up, yeah. Yeah. and you're going to have a new, new, new bike, new yeah. everything. It's yeah. going to be slick as. Yes, yes, guys. So we just checked out all of the tech equipment, and yeah, one word, epic. Can't wait to get it all hooked up to the bike. So yeah, absolutely sick, man. Big up views once again for making this happen. So guys, what is next? Well, we're gonna do a bit of 3D modeling. We're gonna do a bit of rapid prototyping. Essentially, metal's expensive, takes a load of time to cut and shape. Yep. So rather than use something that we might ruin, we're gonna use cardboard. It's cheap, quick, and easy. And we start to get a real feel for what your new bike is gonna look like. This is the frame for your new bike. Yep, so this yep. is what we're gonna be building your new mixing desk to. Yep. Little storage units either side yeah. for bits and bobs. Yeah. And then behind you've got your battery, you've yeah, got yeah. your bag stuff, and then up here in this area, yeah. you've got shelving in, yeah, where yeah. you've got all your other tech yeah, yeah. stored, your spare battery, maybe even a little toolbox in yeah, there. Yeah, yeah. We like the curve. Yeah, like it's the curve. gonna change the whole look of the bike, but this is just gonna take it to the next level visually yeah. as well as technically. Can't wait to get it going, honestly. It's gonna be good. All right, guys, so we have got a very nice mock-up aspect of what the bike is going to look like. Uh, Mike and Jim are absolutely sound, and uh, yeah, we've managed to come together with all of our ideas. Really, massive shout-out to Views. Can't wait to come back and carry on with uh, Mike and Jim. Yeah, get this project done.